The Russian fake production works with the full power from the very first day of the war. The Russian media and moreover the Russian officials claim that the president of Ukraine Volodymyr Zelensky left Ukraine long time ago. Volodymyr Zelensky had to personally disprove this fake news many times. Therefore, the news that the Ukrainian president escaped is fake. The biggest fake of these days, the meeting of the Russian president Vladimir Putin with the representatives of the Aeroflot company. The thing is that Putin wouldn't let anyone close to him for months now and all of a sudden face-to-face -face meeting. Odd, isn't it? However, thanks to the attentive internet users, it is all clear now. There is a moment in the so-called live when Putin's hand magically goes through the microphone. In addition, the film and the TV professionals noticed another range of evidences. Consequently, this conference is fake. By the way, even Zelensky responded to the Russian leader and proved once again he is in Kyiv, not somewhere else, in a bunker. Military biological programs sounds like sci-fi. But the great Russian information agencies say they exist in Ukraine. This is what several military forces of radiation, chemical and biological defense are confident about. Moreover, Russians think that Ukraine created these with Pentagon. To add, they assume that there is a secret CIA and security service of Ukraine prison. There is no point to comment on this nonsense, as it is fake. Only the well-stuffed professional army is fighting for Russia. This is what the occupiers say. В этой операции принимают участие только профессиональные военные. However, the Ukrainians know for sure it is just a myth because there are way too many unexperienced youngsters among the soldiers. Some of them claim that they were forced to sign the contract. Formally, because of the contract, they really are professionals, but really, come on, it is fake.